Hello guys, <laughs> if you can hear me. Welcome back to some more Sniper Elite V2. That, that thunder is pretty loud, eh? Wait, who sees me? Oh, you do. Say I'm pretty pissed at this now that I actually know what I'm doing. Ah, I only like only took off part of your skull. This one else just took his butt. No one else, um here. Oh, he's just like, oh man, down. Where? Wow. Not alone. You just keep on coming. How many are there? <laughs> My goodness. Looks like no one is in there for now, so I'm just gonna walk right in here. I prone. <laughs> it's one of those moments where I wish I knew how to prone. So X is dead, so... Oh, hold it down. That's prone. Okay. Just hold C down and you're prone. You bet I'm hiding somewhere. You have not been Dynamite? Oh, I just, just give me a little while and I'll... Oh, it's fine, I already killed a lot of them up here. Okay, well he walked out. Anyone else? One's behind me, right? I hope not. Wait, who's who's shooting? Oh, I see. Jungle juice. Ouch, ouch, ouch. Where are you? It's always so brutal when that happens. It's alright, my job is to kill everyone. My job is to get up here. Oh, 
my goodness. Ah, oh, that sucks. I didn't see that guy. There we go. Does he regret killing me now, huh? I hope so, otherwise it'll be weird if he enjoys the pain. Here we are. All right, this is what I had to do. Now what? hope not. I hope there is like a limit to how many there can be. Everybody, huh? I think I hit his spine actually. Sometime. Come on. Come on.
Deswegen launched. Ist der Timer? Ich hab jetzt volle Fuel. Oh, I just have to hold out. There we go. What? I tried to snipe it. <laughs> God damn it, really? Oh, I had to shoot that one. Okay, I see. chance to take out Wolf was at the Tiergarten airstrip. 1845 hours. I didn't have much time. Stopping Wolf meant heading straight back into the heart of Berlin. With most of the city in ruins, the only location for the shot was right back where I started. I needed to get to the Brandenburg Gate. The city was on fire. The battle raging. Like a vision of hell. And somewhere, in the middle of that firestorm, that bastard was gonna get in a plane and fly to safety, taking all the secrets of the rocket program to Moscow. Unless I could stop him. Unless we could stop him, dude. <laughs> I, just, I just had to feel cool for a little bit, alright? We can do this together, okay? Sure you will. <laughs> All right, anyone else? <laughs> Very much out. Where should we from now, huh? Grenade, grenade, grenade! Run away! Gotta wait. Is that a broken one or is that like a one that works? I don't know. Oh. Part of me don't even want to figure that out. I think it's one that's broken, so I, th I think it should be good. Hiding. I'm literally out in the open. There you go, I even helped you find me. I 
love X-ray. If he hits me, yeah, I call teats. <laughs> That's all I say. Swing <laughs> all the way <laughs> around. You can't hit me now, eh? doing he's running oh, I see what he's doing. and a push Okay, never mind. <laughs> He's like yelling, oh man down, help! <laughs> ah, he's fine. He, he, he doesn't need help. Not, I don't even use that mines. I'm on top of this because like, it feels like. Oh, wait, I can see him now. Five meters, huh? Um, hello? <laughs> oh great, Mom spawned. What's with all the snipers having the same hairstyle? That was 
weird. Didn't really work right. Yes, the face you had. He's like, What? What just happened? Oh, God, it's not with the pit on no way, actually. Oh well. Wow, okay, that, that's two in a row, huh? Where are you? Yeah, I thought it was two in a row, was, uh, was too good. Here we are, what do I have to do now? Another one? Oh my goodness. I really hate it when enemies just spawn out of nowhere. It's a big pain in the butt to deal with. Submitting in here, huh? Dead bodies. And a gold bar. I have six now, even though I'm pretty close to being done with the whole game. <laughs> the next morning, May 2nd, 1945, when Commander General Weidling submitted the surrender of German forces to General Chukov of the Red Army. Within a few days, the war ended, but already a new war was beginning, the Cold War, and I was its first soldier. Okay, well, I'm gonna make that into uh, the same video. <laughs> There's some editing. But it, it's a short game, but I enjoyed, like, the beginning was some mad because using a controller. I recommend using a mouse for this game, to be honest. It is way easier. Um, but yeah, my thoughts on the game. Um, first of all, the beginning I was like meh. Once again, I used controller and I didn't know how to aim. And it just kind of walked you through the basics without actually teaching you the basics. So instead of them teaching why you should lay down landmines and how the enemy actually reacts, it's just like, all right, lay down a landmine, put a mine here, and then later you'll see that they actually get used and they are useful. Uh, now about the whole enemy um, 
And I mean the whole x-ray thing I mean. Where you shoot an enemy and suddenly you can see the whole stuff. I love it. I love the idea. And I also love how they have a setting to like turn it off I think and make it so it's every shot or something like that. And it's, it's, it's very cool. I like it. Gameplay, it does what it should. It's an old game as well, I think way back from 2000 something. Uh, 8, 9, 10, around that, maybe 12. Uh, it can be hard at times, but that's okay. Uh, the save files, like, it saves as soon as you can read an objective. I don't like that, because <laughs> I had to go through a level again and again at some point. It wasn't too much fun. It, it was meh. It was kind of alright, but not really. So, there's that. Story-wise, it's actually alright. The story is not special and it's not too little. It's, it's, it's kind of just there, you know. It's kind of like... Um, yeah, yeah I, I guess the story is there and it's enjoyable, so it, it's a story and, and it, it's better than most stories I've seen actually, so that's always something. We don't really think too much about the story while playing, you just kind of play to two things. I don't like how it is based off of small missions, like... One mission is you blow up bridge and suddenly you enter the next mission where, and then it gives us more description, you have to do this and that and that. It doesn't feel linear enough, that, that's the only problem I have had with like the whole story based thingy and you go into the different areas. It doesn't really feel linear to me. That's the only thing. The linear thing is that you have to kill these guys, obviously, and then you encounter this project thingy where they are launching a nuke at, or a bomb or missile thing, thing at New York or whatever it was in London I mean in, uh, towards London and then uh, they get gassed pretty much with this gas that they had and you'd prevent that and then you then kill the guy responsible for it So it's not too bad of a game, and it's not exactly the best game in the world, but it's a solid 7 to be honest, like it's a very solid 7. It's not even close to being an 8, it's not close to being like an, an, a, a 6, it's just a normal 7. Nothing can push it up, nothing can push it down, it's just, it just kinda has its foothold there. So I'm gonna have to say that 7, yes, I'm, I'm gonna rate this game as 7. Gameplay good, story is all right. It, it's it's not too exciting. It's not too little. It's just it's just all right. Character, it, it's all right. You hear his voice. You understand the character. That's a, a very big. There's no reason it was a big part, but like it's a, it's a good part that you can identify with the character and understand him. And I felt like I could at least understand the character, even though he didn't show too much personality throughout the whole thing. But through your gameplay, you kind of felt his personality because he's like just a sniper who does what he's told to do, and then he, he's not a, he he sees a situation, then he deals with that situation. And I and I do like how the character is. Uh, except that I wish there were more allies that could teach us who the character is because like all we get is like I never played the first game so I don't know if this is the same guy or if the third game is the same guy but we didn't really get to learn his personality too much it was more like thrown in there boom all right so who is this guy you make that up yourself he's just a sniper elite all right I can I can do that and it's all right uh, I have nothing against that. Like I said, solid 7, enjoyed everything past the first two missions. You can probably also, you know, look at my first two missions and then see like how that goes. Let's continue what happens. I just goes in here again, okay. 
But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this playthrough. If you did, don't forget to click that like button. And if you also want to see more playthroughs from me, such as thousand, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel. Just check out my channel to see if there's anything you would like to see. Otherwise, I have nothing more to say other than stay awesome. <laughs>